Now, let's join the crew at the job site as they hold their tailgate session. During the session, they discuss the job to be done and the responsibility of each crew member. In addition, they review company safety procedures regarding the change out of capacitors to make sure that everyone is fully aware of what is expected of them. Any special safety considerations due to the specific job or location are also covered at this time. As part of the preparation for the job, the new capacitor bank and its control wires are visually inspected to check that they are in good condition and that all of the necessary parts are there. Once the capacitor bank is ready for installation, a line worker goes up and rubbers up the neutral. Before continuing, a quick visual inspection of the capacitor bank and pole is made to look for anything unusual or out of place. Before the bank can be rigged for removal, the primaries need to be rubbered up to make the work area safe. The line workers jumper each bushing of each capacitor unit to the frame ground connection. This eliminates the possibility that the capacitor is still charged. The capacitor bank is now electrically isolated and discharged. Before the capacitor bank is removed from the pole, all of the connections to other equipment have to be undone and secured. The line workers carefully disconnect and remove the control cables from the control box, and the leads connecting the bank to the fused cutouts are unbolted and removed. The jumpers are then coiled and secured and can be used later on the new bank. Finally, the ground connection between the frame and the pole is disconnected. The capacitor bank is now physically disconnected from the system. A material handling bucket truck is used to rig the bank for removal. Once the derrick is in position, the line from the boom is attached to the frame of the capacitor bank so that the bank will remain upright when it's free from the pole. A test strain is taken to make sure that the rigging is going to do the job. Then, the bolts holding the brackets to the pole are loosened and the bank is lifted free from the pole. The line worker maintains control of the bank while being lowered to the ground. Thank you.